Hey guys, it's Tony Old Boy Tonard here, and uh, just figured I need to come on here and uh, tell you guys some stuff. So, as y'all know, the coronavirus is going around, and uh, there's been a lot of schools shutting down, and uh, turns out that our school will be shutting down. Tomorrow's our last day until April, so we'll be shut down an awful while. And other reason why I came on here is also because we had a tornado earlier today. Had a horrible tornado earlier, and uh, tornado uh, touched down. Uh, where we live at, we live on the edge of a two counties live right on the two count or right on the line of two different counties and uh the tornado was about three or four miles from us which is pretty which is not that far away and i've noticed that ever since that storm has went through the phone reception has been horrible so i figured i'd try to upload this while i can while i got some reception right now I got really good bars right now because where that tornado touched down was in uh, Sunfish, Kentucky, just about five, ten minutes away. It feels like by the crow flies, it'd be about three minutes, maybe. And also, we have NTI days of school, which means non traditional instruction days. Which means we have to do a school. We have to do a school packet a day for fifteen days because we're out for fifteen days and yeah. But yeah, today had a horrible. We had we had some storms come through and a tornado, which we 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 was the only county that got put under a tornado warning. Surprisingly, I don't know how we managed that. Because the weather radio had been going off like crazy and stuff. And, of course, the National Weather Service was supposed to be going down today to measure the, because uh, there has been some tornado damage. But they don't know where exactly it has been, so they're supposed to bring down the National Weather Service some point tomorrow to look at the damage. Because I know the community where I live in, not directly in the main, our county seed, which was Litchfield, Kentucky. Uh, the little community that we lived in, that we live in, was uh, in the tornado warning zone. But the main city of our county was not. Which, of course, if that tornado had have went north... It would have hit my house because it was like two, three, four miles away on the radar. And I want to tell you guys, if a tornado comes near your house, be ready. Be ready. As I will tell you this. During the time that the, that the tornado was just two or three miles away from us, four miles away from us, things got crazy outside. The wind picked up and the rain started going sideways and stuff. I didn't know what the heck was happening. But I was in here watching the weather the whole time. I didn't know what in the world was going on. But yeah. Um, just be ready for if a tornado comes, and also if you guys are no, have known about the coronavirus, if y'all have heard about the coronavirus, don't freak out. Believe me, I want to freak out too whenever I hear about the coronavirus because I get sick and tired of hearing it every day. But it's in the state, so just y'all just be ready for if the coronavirus gets worse. Or impacts any of your family members or stuff. There's ways you can treat it. So anyway, just those of y'all that's 
not in the path of the coronavirus yet. Keep the ones that's in your path in your thoughts and prayers. And that's all I wanted to say from the bottom of my heart. Just be safe and hopefully this stuff will be over with by, by the time spring gets here. Alright, hope alright, hope you all enjoyed this video.